What's going on, y'all? Brother Doug here with another Toku update, or Sentai update, if you would. Uh, I want to cover a lot of things today. You know, they just announced the Kill Reagers. Uh, well, not announced. It's been announced. You know, us fans, you know, looking at leaked stuff. We'll talk about that for a little bit. Also, about the production uh, beyond that. And also, I want to talk about Go Buster episode 41 with Pink Buster. And I haven't blogged about a Go Buster episode and a hot one. So, let's get started. I think they're trying to troll us, though, totally. Because um, now they got Pink Buster. Now, when I think of Pink Buster, I'm thinking of a girl in an actual suit, right? Like the one you're seeing right now. Instead, we get someone that's, you know, in the vein of Aubrey Pink, you know? Not really a ranger, you know, per se, with the full helmet that covers, you know, the entire head. You know, not just the mouth, the entire head, you know, face and everything, the whole thing. But we get trolled like this. And it's funny, because Aubrey Ranger had started off with three rangers, you know, the red, blue, and yellow. So did Go Buster, and those were a three a three starter team, and then two more Rangers came, you know, black and white, and then for Go Buster, gold and silver. So I don't know if they're trying to go down that route as Aubrey Ranger, but it would be nice if later on in the season uh, we see an actual Pink Buster, you know, full helmet, full costumed, everything. And that's just me. I don't know how y'all feel, but it's no coincidence that I'm also wearing this pink shirt don't get me wrong if there's any girls watching i'm 100 percent straight you know i love women i love women to death now let's move on <laughs> and it was cool for for a minute but you know i'm kind of getting sick of these three starter teams well i'm not really getting sick of it because you know my favorite one yeki is a three starter team but you know just the the whole like a key ranger remember how i said it was a cool little take uh one dude two girls they could have did something like that with go buster but instead we got a girl one girl with three dudes, because I don't really count Jay, you know, the gold, uh, <laughs> silver, uh, silver, Jed, Stagbuster, there you go, Stagbuster, Stagbuster, so, um, yeah, they could easily rape, uh, Yoko, but, you know, that's a kid's show, so, I don't know, I'm just rambling in, you know, my crazy mind, I'm like the Joker, the Riddler, James Holmes. <laughs> uh, Koichi Sakamoto, who you guys know, from if you're a Power Ranger fan, you guys know he's a stuntman for Power Rangers. You know, he's been working on Power Rangers since the beginning, you know, since Mighty Morphin. And Koichi Sakamoto is going to be directing the Kyuryuji. And also, it's funny because, you know, since this is a dinosaur-themed Sentai, and next year, the 20th anniversary of Power Rangers, I, I, like, a fan said it on this one website, Hinch and Justice, they said the same thing as me. You know, this being like a birthday present to us, you know, the Americans, the Power Ranger fans. Since, you know, without um, Power Rangers, you know, there's really no, well, I wouldn't say there's, there wouldn't be a Sentai, because Sentai would still be going, but just without Sentai, there wouldn't be a Power Rangers. So, without Power Rangers, there wouldn't be... I guess, an exploitation of Sentai. You know how myself and you guys included, you know, the Americans and people from overseas, like the UK and Australia, we wouldn't have a clue of what Super Sentai is or what Sentai is, what what what, Tuka, what Toku is, you know, like Kamen Rider and such. So thank you, Toei. So you guys think they're going to pay homage again like they did with GoBuster, you know, add in little Power Ranger references. And, uh, and the Keeper Ranger did it too. So uh, how do you guys feel about the suits? Um, I personally thought it was going to be this suit right here. But, you know, a lot of rumors are going around. But anyways, guys, how do y'all feel about the q Reader suits? How do y'all feel about Koichi Sakamoto? Uh, oh, yeah. So, uh, yeah, since Koichi is um, directing it, and since he's been, you know, a known alumni for the Power Rangers series, I wouldn't mind him uh, bringing that whole Power Ranger feel to it. Because remember, he did direct a few episodes of Gokaiger. And remember how I did state that on the last few episodes of Gokaiger, it kind of felt like Power Rangers in Space, you know, the Countdown to Destruction episodes. Didn't it feel like that? And so Koichi Sakamoto directed those episodes. Like, oh, that's why it felt like that. Okay. So it made sense. And if he's bringing that flair to Sentai, then it's a, it's a done deal. Because he should have directed Go Buster. And it would have had a done deal right there. It would have felt like RPM. But that's for another blow. Hell, it's, that's for this vlog. <laughs> so, uh, we gonna see a Japanese Boken Skull? Hmm? What? <laughs> so, how do y'all feel about this whole Q-Ranger news? How do y'all feel about Koichi Sakamoto directing? How do y'all feel about Pink Buster? How do y'all feel about anything? How do y'all feel about life? How do y'all feel about this shirt? <laughs> Alright, man. Uh, enough with the jokes. Uh, make sure y'all follow me on Facebook, Twitter. Like me. Subscribe to me. Video response me. Share with your friends. 
do whatever y'all can stay in contact. And other than that, deuces. Next week's last episode of Power Ranger Samurai. Thank God.